I'm Toby Paddock. I'm going to be bringing you some fresh ideas along with a lot of my chef's secrets to make meal planning easy. Today it's poached eggs with hollandaise sauce. Hollandaise sauce can seem a little bit daunting to make. It's one of the first things you make at chef school when you become an apprentice. Every chef's got his own way of doing it. I'm going to show you guys a really fail-safe way to make excellent hollandaise every single time. One of my tips for getting the most perfectly poached eggs to go with this hollandaise is to use room temperature eggs. Apart from the eggs, you'll also need white vinegar, select butter and English muffins. Click here for the full recipe and to add all the ingredients to your trolley when you shop online. In this pan, I've got 100 grams of butter, and this is a really great little trick to make the perfect clarified butter, which you'll need to make hollandaise. I've melted this over a really, really low heat, and if you can see into the pan, you'll see we've got the curds and the whey actually separated out. And if we pick it up, whatever you do, don't shake it around. You can actually just pour that perfect clarified butter straight into here. OK, we can discard these solid bits here. To pull the hollandaise together, I've got a little bain-marie going here, which is a pot of water. I've got about two centimetres of water in there, and I've got that just coming up to the gentle simmer. Now, I'm going to take a couple of room temperature, free-range eggs, and we're going to need to separate those. Egg yolk goes in. And then we put this directly over some simmering water, and now you start to whisk. So absolutely keep whisking this, otherwise you'll end up with scrambled eggs. So you guys can see the stones get really pale, it's thickening, and it's starting to ribbon. By ribbon, I mean when we drag the whisk through, it actually starts to leave a line in there. It starts to leave a trail. I'm going to pop this just off the heat for a moment while I add half a tablespoon of water into there and a tablespoon of fresh lemon juice. Give it a little bit of a whisk to combine all that together. So now we go back onto the heat and we can start to add in the butter. This is a bit like making a mayonnaise now. So you add in the clarified butter just a little bit of a time while you keep whisking the whole time to make sure it gets absorbed. I'm going to take this off the heat and we'll add the remainder of the butter in now. Okay, now we season with salt and a small amount of cracked pepper. That's that done. Finished, ready to go. You guys now know how to make hollandaise. So we want to keep this warm. I'll turn that right off the heat. We'll put it to the side. For the perfect poached eggs, we're going to add two tablespoons of white vinegar into this water, and the acid in the vinegar will really help the white stick together. You could just grab the eggs and put them right into there. In kitchens, we've been taught to put them into a cup. Grab yourself a spoon and really carefully just start to get this water in a whirlpool motion. By getting the water to spin as we lower the egg into there, that white will really start to curl over the yolk, and the acid from the vinegar will help the egg to set perfectly. Lid goes on and we let these sit three to five minutes depending on how you like them cooked. Just before your eggs come out, give that hollandaise a little last whisk and look at that. That white's perfectly kind of folded over the yolk. So take yourself a little plate with some kitchen paper. I tend just to pick it up and just get rid of any of that excess water. And then we can pop it straight on. So this is beautiful, it's ribboning, it's ready to go. And then take a spoon and nappe right, oh yeah. Look at that, it's so beautiful and silky. Straight over the top of that egg. You didn't think you could do it, but now you can with this super easy trick tip on how to make hollandaise. Perfect poached eggs with hollandaise sauce. Now, if you like that, all ingredients can be purchased at your local Woolies and online by clicking here. To subscribe to our YouTube channel, click here. To explore all our other fresh idea recipes, click here. And for more quick and easy recipes, click here.